Well, got to do an on the water fix real quick. Got a wobbly handle. It's no big deal though. Always keep a Shimano wrench on your keys just in case stuff like this happens. And try not to lose any screws. So I caught two shakers so far. Tried drop shotting, but it's way too snaggy over here. So I put on a 454 SS prototype with a 5/8 ounce smelt head. So uh, that's what I'm throwing right now. Oh no, the wind blew my my screw. God damn it! Oh, I got it right here. That was scary. Alright, back to what we're doing. Damn, it was hella loose. A little bit more. Or a little less. Let's go a little more. Boom. That's definitely it right there. Bam. Put that screw back in. And we'll be back to fishing. Sorry, I'm videotaping my crotch, but that's the only place to do this right now. <laughs> good, we're good. So here's the bait. Right here. It's a little dirty. It was sitting in the rocks right now. Alright, let's get back to fishing. Designed a new lure, the 327 SS, like a drop shot swim bait. Gonna test it right now, but I'm a little worried that I made the tail too thin. Well, let's see though. Two-aught straight shank worm hook. I'm gonna use a one-ounce sinker. Measuring the distance. I want the hook to pop out. Just thread it like a worm. Kinda swims. Oh, well, it swims, but I think it can swim a little better. So it does swim, actually pretty nice, but I want to make one more version of it with a little wider tail so it kicks a little harder because I mean, people like that, fish like that, so there'll be a version too. But let me keep fishing it right now and uh, see what happens. It looks good though.
go. Nice one. testing that drop shot using the lighter line some 20 pound supernatural mono by sunline and um, I was risking it there was a lot of eel grass and stuff getting on my rig so I cut off the drop shot and tied on a 454 SS golden bear chartreuse tail that 5 8 ounce machine lure works smelt head man and sure enough when I hook a donkey broke water kind of looked like a halley or a striper couldn't tell it's already dark and that thing peeled line stopped on the ledge took off again and freaking sawed me off man Oh well, that's what, man, I just hate saying it, but that's definitely uh, what keeps us coming back, the ones we lose, and we remember those way more than the ones we catch. 